Ladies and gentlemen, this is your lovely host here once again. It is Team Right Right. Now, before we go any further, I was just wondering anyone out there on social media had a chance, the opportunity to watch my video from earlier today. If not, smash a bell. You will get a notification from YouTube, hopefully. If not, there's always a plan B. Hit the subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment from the article, share it, whoever loves wrestling news and all that hoopla. Um, that really sums it up, and check out the video from earlier today. The article will be down below, my other social media accounts will be down below, same thing for right now. Thank you very much, now it is time once again to discuss wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of awesome information to discuss for you. So sit back, relax, feel free to grab some meat, grab some drink. Now if you don't do it like that, maybe you want you like a villain, and hear my thoughts, my opinions, on the subject, and of course the article will be down below. Let's rock and roll. Now recently, WWE had this period called the WWE Super Showdown. Now for the first time ever in WWE history, it was um, Goldberg versus The Undertaker. It was a dirty match. No, it was not a dirty match. It was a freaking train wreck. It was. In my opinion, okay? Now, what am I going to say? Um, oh, yeah. I got interrupted. I got a distraction. I hate that. But anywho, um... It was awful. Not because Goldberg performed very, very poorly. Taker did a very, very poorly job. But everyone on social media is bashing Goldberg <clears throat> on, that, on his horrible performance. So I totally agree with everyone out there. That match should not happen in 2019, okay? Goldberg had his time back in the day. And for some flipping reason, W. Brung back, had his short universal title run, and that's still pissing me off at this day. You know, it's, it makes me mad. I don't know if you guys agree or not. You know, Taker and Goldberg are both freaking old, okay? But they always say two to tangle. And I think if Goldberg, I don't know what happened with Goldberg, you know, but let me get off the subject here. W has no desire to contact Goldberg. Thank flipping God, okay? Um, so I don't want to see Goldberg on TV anymore. This is 2019 anymore. I mean, that's great. He's in W Hall of Fame. That should be a son off. There's no reason in hell to keep bringing him back. Any people who's in the Hall of Fame, quit bringing them back, okay? Just use the guys they have on TV. If no one does not give a crap about your product, that is your fault, McMahon. Don't make your product any edgier. That's why a lot of you, us, are moving over from WWE to AEW. It's the biggest thing right now. Since sliced bread. I'm just kidding. But you know who, according to a report, Brad Brad Sherman, WWE has no plans of Dolph Ziggler facing Goldberg. Thank flipping God. That match would be another disaster. Depends him taking sh sh direct shots at, at him. In recent weeks, in fact, W and Goldberg are not on speaking terms as for now. Thank flipping God. I don't want to see Goldberg versus Dolph Ziggler whatsoever. Probably be another train wreck. Um, so what's your thoughts on this? Probably eventually W will talk to Goldberg. Probably in a freaking match or whatever. Is Goldberg really needs that kind of money? No, I don't think so. He should have had all that money. He should have saved off. From his his days in WCW and his days short days in WWE, you know, I don't know why they put him in Hall of Fame just because he was undefeated for the longest time. I prefer someone who would really deserve being a W Hall of Fame, but I know a lot of you don't like the W Hall of Fame. It's like a joke. That's your opinion, not mine. And that is some of the wrestlers like Goldberg. He thinks uh, the Hall of Fame is a freaking joke. He's in the Hall of Fame, so of course you're complaining, you know. Now, Goldberg was, he was very awesome in the w, WCW, okay? Some people don't like him because he's on the street, feeder streak, but he faced a lot of jobbers in the, be, in the beginning. He didn't face no top guys right away, in my opinion, okay? So, um, and then the, I mean, WCW 
make Goldberg as a ripoff as Austin in a different version, you know? So, what's your thoughts on this article? Whatever, you know? And hopefully, WWE does not change their mind and talk match Goldberg for this, um, Dolph Ziggler. I don't want to see this match. Everyone, let me know what you think about the rest of the article. Sorry if I talked so fast. Don't judge me, okay? The way how I talk, you know? <clears throat> I, I didn't uh, Really mind that Goldberg's in the Hall of Fame, but if you're in the Hall of Fame, don't come back whatsoever. Maybe you act special appearances, but don't have a freaking match. Let the young guys take over the business, in my opinion. So, what's your thoughts on this article? And everyone out there, enjoy your rest of your Friday and have an excellent weekend. And that wraps it up. Have, sorry, enjoy your rest of your Friday and have an excellent weekend from your lovely host here, Team Rai Rai. Have a good one, and hopefully you enjoyed the video from earlier today and the video from right now. Later, Batman freaking rocks. Later.